He's kind of like, he, he's kind of working as fast as I used to. Excellent work. We will transfer 20k to your account. Sweetness. Alright. Create custom game engine. This one should have open world. Is that it? Alright. We're not even going to bother naming the games. It's whatever. Ninvento announced the much anticipated successor to the popular test console. This is the greatest console we have ever built. Uh, fans around the world have been waiting for this moment, yada yada, blah da blah. Yeah, as you can see, this number is going down super fast now. So, I gotta be careful with it. I gotta be careful with every cent now. Your new game engine. Game engine number three is now complete. Let's, uh, I really, I really don't, but I kind of have to. So you know what? I'll get the license. I'll get the license for it. I'll just make, yeah. I'll make it everyone. Medium game. Pick topic. We're going fantasy. And then we're going to go RPG, Fan Oasis, on... Game Engine 3. Then we're going to make this one. That's right, you guys guessed it. First Fantasy. Three. Kind of makes sense considering we're going into our third thingy. Alrighty. Creating larger games is a significant task, and unlike in small games, one person cannot effectively be responsible for every aspect of the game. To create a good game and make the best use of your team, you'll have to assign which of your team is responsible for which areas. Pick team members whose skills match the area to get the best result. When you assign a team member responsibilities, you will see their workload. Try not to overwork them. Alrighty. So, story and quests. We can bring, bring these down. Boom, boom. Alright. So we're gonna give my myself uh storing quests. Can you handle this? Yeah, you can handle these. Alrighty. We're gonna go ahead and fill this position because we uh, did a stupid thing where we uh, made a medium game and now the workload is intense. Today, a new game platform, Super Test by Ninvento, has been released. Um, whoa! 34k per month. Nope! You're level 3 right away. You can eat a dick, Kyle. Eat a a dick. Ha! <laughs> Look at you. Alrighty. Uh, artificial intelligence doesn't matter too much. Level design is good. Alright. Can I give myself this? Oof. Fuck. Um. You know what? Let's pull him. Let's let's pull him off. We'll switch them. There we go. Keep them low. I'll keep high with what I gotta do. Then we'll train him. Oh, fuck. Alright, graphic is good. Let's bring that down. Let's bring the world design down a tad. Can you handle this? Yes. Can you handle this? Ooh, fuck. Barely. I'm at 110%. That's not gonna work. We can bring the sound down a little bit more. Uh, 
Alrighty. Workload on them. There we go. 100%, 100%, 100%. Open world. <sighs> Alright, let's see. Let's see how well this game fucking works. I hope it does good. Hi again. I heard that you've been successfully successful in the game business and you're starting to grow your team. I've updated our client list, so if you're looking for some contract work, let me know. Medium-sized contracts have been unlocked. Boss, I've discovered that some really dedicated fans have made a First Fantasy 2. A fa First Fantasy 2 have created a fan game using a lot of material from our game. They don't make any money with it and it just uh and just seem to do it for fellow fans. Our legal advisor strongly suggests that we shouldn't allow this to go on. No, let them be. Come on, man. They're indie developers. Just let them hang out. How do you think I started, nigga? Although, I wasn't making money. Well, I mean, I was making money. Or is there not? <sighs> Ding! New records all around. Two level ups. Another level up. And then, Jesus! New research available. Simple cutscenes. Better dialogues. 2D graphics v1. Okay, we're going with 3D graphics for the next one. First reviews. Come on. I forgot how much it was supposed to have. So I'm hoping that we get enough. One of the best. And great. Close. Hi, I'm Dennis Reed, the main developer of the first Fantasy 2 fan game. I've recently been informed that our legal department, your legal department, advised you to stop us, and I just wanted to say that I'm very grateful that you didn't. Foxy Games is the best company in the world, and I'm glad I can be part of the fan community. We have gained 314 fucking fans. Woo! <laughs> I'm sorry if I got super loud there. Holy shit! Oh, wait, no, that's right, because we did the publishing company. Uh, Capcom. The game meets the acquired ratings. We're looking forward to future pub business. Jesus Christ. Media is abuzz with the latest news. No, nobody cares. Holy shit. Okay, yeah, no, cool. The Yes, it's a PlayStation. It's a PlayStation. Phony, Sony, yeah, it's a PlayStation. Shut up. Shut your mouth. Shut your mouth. <sighs> okay, all right. Oh my god. Holy shit. We've sold over a million fucking units. Oh my god. Guys, I'm gonna be honest. This is the first time I've ever, ever started doing this well on this fucking game. Holy, holy, holy shitballs. That's... Fuck. That's so cool. That, oh my god. I'm so happy. Um, we're going to have him be the tech guy. So your tech, your design. Yeah, you'll be design. And then whenever they're done doing that, we'll... Holy fucking hell. From time to time, your employees need to recharge their batteries. And go on vacation. You can tell an employee needs a rest, but their officially steadily decreases. To give them a holiday, just click on them and send them on vacation. Well, considering he's still in the green, he should be fine. Holy shit. That's going down really, really fast. You need to chill the fuck out, dude. Post-release. Level design seems quite important. Platform genre, RPG, and Ven Oasis is okay. Well, considering we didn't really have control over that last piece. 